of God. Mm -hmm. First thing she said, all I have is just enough for me and my son. Then we will die. If you will honor the Lord, listen, God will prolong your life. Mm. Because God will provide all of your needs. Oh, not just one, not just two, all. Oh. And the third one, the basket level of giving. It says in Deuteronomy 28, verse 5, Blessed shall be your basket. And your needing more. If you got a basket and it's full, everybody knows you got it. And if you got the right spirit, you'll say, I've got it and it's enough for me and it's enough for you too. Listen. The first level of giving is A leader don't even want to give to the work of God mm. because you have a bad mentality. The second one, you honor the man of God. Mm. The third one is this. The Bible says about this young boy Going into a crusade. Amen. And Jesus from the mountain. He saw the crowd. That there's thousands of people. Who are hungry and thirsty. And Jesus start looking for an answer. That they may feed these 5,000 men, excluding women and children. So there's about thousands of people. And Jesus asked all of his disciples and said, Where can we get? Food that we may provide the needs of these people. And every one of them was arguing with Jesus. That's impossible. For that open air place to find a baker. And even if they found a baker, it's impossible for a short period of time to provide bread to pay this people. Hallelujah. Impossible. Even a fast food like McDonald's and Burger King, they cannot provide with this thing. And here comes the boy. Oh, yes! Is his food to survive? Mm. What the Bible says? He has what? Five loaves, two fish. Two fishes and five loaves of bread. In short, this little boy gave everything to Jesus. Amen, yes. He gave. Mm. Hallelujah. Two pieces and five loaves of bread. A lunch. Or it could be a dinner for a little boy. 
And Jesus said, okay, hand me that basket. Ask all of them, all his disciples, go ahead, make sure everyone's sitting down nice. Don't get excited. And Jesus lived up. Hallelujah. That basket coming from the heart of that little boy. Mm. He gave the best that he could hope. And the Bible says, from this basket, he started thanking God the Father. Lord, multiply this. And when Jesus handed the blessing to all of his disciples that his disciples may distribute. Jesus keep on getting! 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 Never run out! And the Bible says because this little boy gave what he has. It multiplies. 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 Amen. Multiply. You want multiplication in your in your finances? Give. Yes. Multiply. It multiplies and the Bible says. Mm. Not just Jesus and his disciples met the needs of that moment. The Bible says there's a breakdown. There's a big portion, a big amount, big volume of food that was left over. Mm. Amen. From two pieces. Five loves. Seven yes. is a number of completion. Yes. <laughs> Jesus was able to provide the need. But the key is this. You have to give. Cheerfully. Mm. And the Bible, without mentioning it, probably has a problem. Because with our mentality today, where's the to go box? <laughs> You didn't get it. <laughs> the problem that they have at the end is where to get and to go back. Uh -huh. Because there is plenty. Plenty of left. Uh -huh. uh -huh. right. Amen. How many here wants a lot of left over? <laughs> Because your back has a hole. <laughs> to having enough. And the last one is to have enough to help others. <laughs> Where you are today? Are you a man and a woman hmm. who desire to have a plenty of leftover or just enough or not enough? Not enough, enough, more than enough, or which one? Yes. More than enough. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus.